Hello and welcome to the series of videos where we will be showing you various features in our stair tool in Open Buildings Designer Connect Edition. Firstly, let us start with the type of stairs available in the Connect Edition and their placement. We open the stair tool by being in the Building Design workflow and then going to the Architectural tab. You will notice the stair tool here. We click on it to start placing the stairs. Now let us place a straight stair. As soon as you select the stair, you will see a straight stair attached to your cursor. You need to provide a data point to place the flight of stairs and then go on to select the direction in which the stair needs to be placed. As you can see, we have the liberty to place the stair in any direction. You need to provide another data point to confirm the direction and as you can see, the straight stair is placed. Now let us place a straight stair with two runs. So this is basically two straight run stairs with an intermediate landing. Similar to the straight run stair, we select the type of stair from the placement ribbon group and enter the first point to place the stair. Next up, the tool will ask us to determine the position of the landing. We select a position as per our choice and the straight run stair with two runs is placed. Here we will place a quarter turn stair. As you have already noticed, the stair placement in general follows a very similar workflow. We will follow that workflow and select the quarter turn stair from the placement ribbon group. Then we will provide a data point to indicate the starting point for the flight of stairs. Another data point to provide the landing position and finally the direction of the second flight which is towards the left or right of the landing. This completes the placement of a quarter turn stair. Here we will see the placement of half turn stair. Let us select the half turn stair from the placement ribbon group. The half turn stair places a U stair between two floors using three points. We provide the first point to place the flight of the stairs. Next, we will provide another point to input the first half landing and the final point to provide the length of the landing and its direction as per our requirement. Here we will place the two quarter turn stair. Let us select the option of two quarter turn stair from the ribbon group. Select the placement point for the stair, provide the landing. After placing the landing, you need to select the direction of the stair. Here we select the right side of the landing. Next, again we need to select the position of the second landing that we require. Subsequently, we need to select the direction of the placement of the final turn of stair. We select the direction to the right of the landing and we have our two quarter turn stair. Here we will be placing a three quarter turn stair. We select the option of three quarter turn stair from the ribbon group. We click to provide the position of the first landing. Next up we select the direction of the next flight. We click again to provide the position of the second landing along with providing the direction of the stair. And finally we provide the position of the final landing as well as the position of the final flight of stairs. This completes the placement of three quarter turn stairs. Don't forget to watch the other videos in this video series to know more about stairs in Open Buildings Designer.